We were the first to break the news of Solis' arrest on Click2Houston.com this afternoon. Channel 2's Michael Lopardi live at HPD headquarters downtown with the newest information tonight. Michael? Dominique, that suspect was initially brought down here to police headquarters following his arrest. This is also where the chief released that surveillance video in hopes of finding a second man. Houston police are now looking for the man with the beard wearing a black shirt in the surveillance video. Chief Art Acevedo is calling him a person of interest in the shooting death of Sergeant Sean Rios. We've got to find that individual and we're not going to stop looking for that individual. We are going to find him. The man you see in the white shirt is the suspect, 24-year-old Robert Solis. He was arrested along Katy Freeway on Tuesday afternoon on a murder charge. The suspect was transported to our homicide division where he has initially been uncooperative. The chief says Rios was on his way to work at Bush Airport on Monday afternoon when he was shot and killed in a gun battle along North Freeway. But how did it start? And we do have 911 calls indicating exchange of gunfire between a white pickup truck and a Mercedes-Benz matching the description of the vehicle that we have in police custody, and that's the suspect's vehicle. And so we believe there's a high probability that Sergeant, uh, Sergeant Rios saw that incident between those two vehicles, and sadly, uh, he ended up losing his life and trying to intervene on that surface street. The chief says Sergeant Rios did not know the suspect, and he didn't offer any details on how the suspect is connected to the person of interest. Right now, police are just hoping to track down the second man. The chief says the DA's office said the suspect might turn himself into them, but police didn't know if that would happen, so they took the suspect into custody when they saw him. An attorney for Solis has scheduled a news conference for tomorrow afternoon, and the chief says a memorial for Sergeant Rios will likely happen next Monday. We're live tonight downtown. Michael Lopardi, KPRC, Channel 2 News. And Michael